Hello everyone, this is Charles Harper. I'm going to be meeting here with David Kassar and he's going to be talking about an interesting way for you to be able to take your skills and then move them to the offline world, whether you want to do consulting or even if you just want to barter your services. Listen in and then there'll also be a URL where you can get the resource, the plrshow.com forward slash DCR. Okay, with that, enjoy the interview. Hey everybody, uh, this is Charles Harper, and uh, I'm with uh, David Kassar. And David uh, teaches, uh, you know, small business consultants, in particular, people who are new to the whole thing. And if, if you're listening, and you know, you're, you're kind of thinking, I want to try to get started. I'm not really into the whole cold calling aspect of it. Um, I want you to listen in because we're going to talk about some things that you can do to, I, I guess, overcome those things and to see if this is something that you want to do. And for those of you who, you know, you're experienced, right? And, you know, you, you know, you, maybe you hit a plateau in terms of actually getting people to pay you, you know, to do the consulting. And I want you to listen in also because I think there's help for you too. David, uh, good to talk to you. Hey, Charles, thanks for having me today. It's a real pleasure to be here today with you. David, um, what, one of the things that I remember when I, you know, started and I was trying to consult, the thing that kind of frustrated me was not really knowing, you know, if I could do two things. Number one, um, I'm not a sales personality, right? And so I don't, you know, I'm, I'm, not a, I'm not a flashy kind of person. You know, what kinds of things can you do to start talking to people to help them to get over the hump uh, to, I guess, make that contact to get that initial customer? Yeah, well, uh, it's funny that you say that because I, I, you know, I was exactly the same way uh, when I first started. Like, I'm not the selling type of person at all, uh, and I went through many, many years of trial and error. Um, you know, I tried to, um, you know, create a sequence to get new customers via email because I didn't really want to talk to anybody over the phone or anything like that. Um, so I basically went through a lot of trial and error, figuring out what worked and what didn't work. Uh, and, and throughout that entire process of you know making contact with a potential customer, uh, and then not you know off, and then converting that contact into an actual client that pays you month in month out tens of thousands of dollars. What um, was a little bit of a process, and that's really why I put together the consultants pack. Um, so there's, a, there's actually a sequence uh, that I go through, uh, and one of them is well, the first thing you'll need is you know having the right keywords to target. Do you want me to go through the the exact process that I use to get to get clients? Well, not 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 the full sequence. I guess the the main thing is is I, I wanted to kind of just kind of make sure that I'm not crazy. That there are <laughs> ways for people, <laughs> you know, who are not just just not that outward person that there are ways that you can overcome those things in order to get people to give you a shot so okay so let's say i'm i'm just starting out i'm i'm new and i'm going to approach this um what kinds of things can i j just kind of expect right if if let's say they go through your process am, am, am i going to have to you know am i going to have to kind of am i going to be on the phone or what can i expect yeah, so the, the things that you can expect are that you'll, you'll be receiving uh, all of the keywords that are proven to convert. So over the years, I have uh, tried and tested and uh, invested tens of thousands of dollars in figuring out what keywords actually lead to uh, converting you know, a website visitor into an actual lead. Um, so one of the things you, you will expect is to get the exact keywords that I've used to close, um, you know, loads of local businesses uh, uh, through my lead generation pages. The, the other thing you'll expect is you'll get the exact landing pages that I use. You know, these are the these are the landing pages that I've spent tens of thousands of dollars on traffic, uh, sending traffic, you know, fine tuning and tweaking. Now, now these pages they're not the sexiest pages in the world, but they just work like clockwork uh, and. Really, in a nutshell, you know, the biggest thing to expect is not having to go through all of the heartache, you know, the blood, sweat, and tears of trying to figure it all out 
and spending tens of thousands of dollars throughout that process because it's all been done for you. So now the person kind of, let's say that now the person they make contact with me. Um, yeah. The other thing that kind of I talked about, two things that kind of frustrated me, and the other thing that kind of, I guess, discouraged me was that I never knew quite how to figure out what to offer, right? Mm -hmm. So so, so, are there ways, I mean, or, or are you helping people to figure out what are the best services to offer? Because not everybody, I'm guessing, needs, you know, full-blown SEO, social media. So are there ways to figure out what they, what they, what they need? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So throughout this process, we not only, you know, uh, give our students uh, the exact process we follow to generate leads, but we also give you the exact process to help these local businesses generate leads, uh, get more sales, and get more clients. So basically what you're trying to do in your business or, or in the consultant's business and then get the consultant to do for their business exactly. is lead generation, right, if I understand yeah. you right? Exactly. It's mainly lead generation. But uh, if there is a local business that has physical products that they want to move and they want to start an e-commerce store, you can use the exact same process to uh, convert those visitors into sales for local businesses. So it's not just lead generation. It can be used to help local business generate leads, get more sales if they're selling physical product, or get more clients if they're offering some kind of you know, one-on-one -on -one consulting service. So when you talk about e-commerce in mm -hmm. a local area, um, mm -hmm. t talk about that. What what is that? What is that? What what is that going to help that business to do? You know, they're selling physical products, I, I, and and I meet a lot of people that just don't even know where to where to start. So you're saying that if they have physical products, they're you know they're out there competing with Amazon, they're competing with all these big companies. Are they going to be able to kind of kind of work with the consultant to get local traffic to some of those things exactly exactly because it's the exact same process uh, and you know we've got um, we've got really good support to help our, our students you know if they can get if they get back to us and say hey we've just closed a local uh, hair salon uh, where we're helping them get more bookings but they've got a lot of shampoos that they want to move um, they can always write in to me or my support team and we'll always help them and point them in the right direction to help them uh, in what they need to do to help that local business sell more physical product. Uh, it's, not, it's not a major thing, but it's usually leads and, uh, and getting more clients through lead generation. But there's a lot of local businesses, for example, like hair salons that do have physical products that they would love to move online and you can use the exact same process in the consultants pack to to do that as well and, and are, are you are you helping people with with uh, with Google um, in terms of you know the, the, the ads and let's say PPC I know it's not as popular anymore now that you know we're now into really Facebook ads and Twitter and social media yeah. but but are you, are you helping people to kind of oh, to, to integrate Google ads into that also yeah, exactly. So uh, we, I have over 20 niche markets and uh, that, that are completely done for you, and we've got all the Google ads that have been pre-written. So you don't even have to think about what to write in the ad, all the ad copies being written for you. Uh, and I actually have a team of designers, and we've created uh, all the display banner ads on Google as well for 20 different niche markets. And... Um, we're actually adding another 20 niche markets, so we should have 40 niche markets by the 3rd of February as well. So all the all the Google ads have been pre-written, done for you as well. Yeah. Now the the other thing I I I I wouldn't call it a struggle. Um, it was just a little intimidating. Was you know actually thinking about um, you, you know you know I, I, I don't know what you call it a, a contract. Or, or you know, what do you, you know, what do you put in front of them? You yeah. Know, when you're first trying to make the deal. You're trying to yeah. figure out, okay, do I, you know, are we shaking hands? Are we, you know, the <laughs> PayPal invoice? You know, okay. Yeah. So, yeah. so what do you I do about that? that? Yeah. So over the years, I have put together a 
proposal template uh, that I've personally used to close Fortune 500 clients. Um, I've helped Avon, Ernst & Young, you know, close certain deals like that using this exact proposal template. And you're right, you know, a lot of people, uh, they learn, you know, they might get to the stage where they learn how to generate the lead and then they're like, okay, so what now? <laughs> what do I do? How do I close this thing? Uh, and so I put together a proposal template that's completely done for you. Uh, where you know you would obviously need to change the company name and uh, fine-tune a few things but there are many pages in this proposal template that have been pre-written uh, for all of the consultants pack students and all they need to do is just fine-tune and tweak it so yeah you're right it's really intimidating to sit down and write a proposal but we've I've written it in a way where it's completely evergreen and that it can be applied to so many different niche markets um, so they don't have to create something completely unique for any other new leads that come in. Uh, they just simply make some fine-tuning changes and then they send it out to that potential client. Now, the other intimidating part is, okay, so what, what, what do you do after that? You know, you've, you've generated the lead uh, and then you've uh, sent out this flashy proposal. Yeah. Uh, and then, and then you need the follow-up. You know, there's there's a sequence to to this entire process, uh, and it doesn't stop at the proposal. Uh, I've I've pre-written quite a few emails um, that you send uh, pre-proposal as a question to get you know to find out more information, which involves a questionnaire that I've done for you as well. Uh, and then after you get all that information from the client. Uh, you then send them the proposals. So all those emails have been written as well. And then what do you do when, when they don't respond? You know, what, what do you do if, if they, you know, maybe the price was too high or, um, you know, they're getting cold feet. I've also got emails pre-written for that as well uh, to, to push them over the line or to find out, you know, whether they're just tire kickers or they're just genuinely busy and couldn't get back to you. So all of those, yeah, those pre-written emails, uh, when I first started, it was super intimidating. You know, what do I do? You know, I've sent out this proposal. They're not responding. So I just went through several uh, years of testing different responses to see which one worked the best, and I just put it in this pack. Yeah, see, that's what I like about this is that this is something you did kind of trial and error. In other words, you, you, didn't, you didn't put all this together and just kind of throw it out here. This is stuff that you have yeah. learned in the School of Hard Knocks, and yeah. now you're you're kind of bundling it up and you're giving it to people who let's say have never consulted right so if, if i let's say if i never consulted could i take this conceivably and mm -hmm. and expect that if i work at it right i should I, I i might be able to at least come close to getting getting somebody to give me money yeah exactly so if, if you're completely fresh and complete newbie and you know, you're interested in uh, helping local businesses uh, or, or any business, you know, using this consultants pack, you can literally jump in and follow the steps, use our landing page, use the pre-written uh, PPC ads to generate the lead, uh, use the follow-up email sequence with questionnaires and proposals. You know, I guarantee you will generate leads. Uh, then it's a matter of, you know, converting those leads into actual clients, which my follow-up sequence then helps as well. Yeah. Now you know. Uh, you know. You talk about. You know. You talk about generating leads. Um, you know. Part of the. Part of the sort of process of. You know. Even once somebody comes to the website the first time, is is sort of the copy. And I know some people. Um, I'm used to the online world. I know what the co I sort of know what the copy needs to say on the landing page. I'm a little sketchy on what you might say <laughs> on a landing page for somebody in a local business. I mean, um, it, 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 is, there, is there help for people who just kind of need to know what that website needs to say, Yeah. right, so yeah. that people go ahead and maybe at least they opt in? Yeah, exactly. Um, well, because we have several different niches, the, the messaging can be quite different, which you've actually written for, we've created landing pages uh, for every single niche market. So all the headlines, all the bullet points, all the call to actions, everything's been done uh, for them. In fact, if you're, if you're like me and, obviously, and like yourself, you know, you're a bit intimidated by selling, maybe a bit introverted. Uh, I've also created this video sales letter, sales video, uh, 
um, that does all the selling for you. So you can either put uh, leave the landing pages with the image, uh, the hero image, or you can use this completely done for you video sales letter that does all the selling for you. So you don't have to worry about what to write on this landing page. All the headlines have been done, all the bullet points have been done, the call to actions, and also the video sales letter has been done as well. Now, that's cool, man. I, I have in the past, um, you know, just kind of done stuff for for barter, right? And I know some people are listening, they don't necessarily want to be consultants, but they but they are interested though in helping, you know, I don't know, their 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 dentist or their plumber and all these other people. They're helping the interest in helping these people get more business, even if it's just to kind of trade some trade up for stuff. So so this is for that person who maybe just wants to help a business to get more business, even if they're not necessarily trying to get a fee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You could do it that way if you wanted to. Uh, if you are doing it that way, I actually did start out doing it that way um, because when you start out, sometimes you feel like you're completely unknown. You know, I'm going back ten plus years here, uh, and when I when I got a few mortgage, I actually started out in the mortgage uh, industry, mortgage helping mortgage brokers generate more leads, uh, and I would help you know one or two people, one or two businesses and get them to provide me with a testimonial. Then I'll grab those testimonials and I'll put them on my landing page and I'll, and I'll say, okay, well, I'll help you out if, you can, uh, if you're happy to you know, be a reference and give me a testimonial. And that's worked out really well, just having that social proof on your website. So if, if you are listening and you're just starting out, you know, I would highly recommend you know, helping out. Even if you have a family friend in a local business, uh, help them out, get them to help you with the uh, testimonial of their success that they've received by you helping them out. Uh, and that just goes such a long way, you know, just when people see. And then you actually gain so much more confidence, right? Like when when people come to your site and they see that testimonial, like, and you're, you're confident enough to say, hey, here's that person's phone number, give them a call. They're quite happy to give you a reference on, on my services. Uh, it just goes such, such a long way, and it really helps you. It's like that stepping stone. You know, and once you get over that, uh, that hurdle of people doubting you for whatever reason because you don't have any, um, any other client, you know, uh, portfolio, uh, it just helps you a lot. Yeah, I'm looking here, and so w w I, I could conceivably say, okay, well, this month. You know, I can just put a message out there and I'll say, hey, I'm willing to help one chiropractor this month. And then maybe next month I'd say, I'm willing to help one plumber this month. And that's an easy way to either, I mean, even if, you, that's an easy way to kind of build up that kind of credibility that you're talking about. Yeah, definitely, definitely. I'd highly encourage doing that. All right. Now, um, okay, so 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 now I'm, I'm looking at this um, and and obviously, I mean, you've got quite a bit in here, and a lot of this stuff is your experience, and you've put this together. Um, <laughs> um, okay, so, uh, David, why, why is it so cheap? <laughs> so, well, yeah, so basically, uh, I, I'm actually in the early adopter phase right now, and I'm actually doing this to get more success stories. So whenever, so if you're listening right now, and you, you know, grab, jump in on my consultants pack. Uh, I want to know when you get that first lead. I want to know when you make that first sale. You know, when you when you get that first payment. I want to know about it, uh, and that's really the trade here because. Uh, I will be bumping this up to $997 for this full, full pack, and uh, and I'm offering it at a super, super, super crazy low price. You are. Because I want to know about your success. I want to hear it. I want to be able to use that. And it just goes back to what I said before, you know, just helping helping local business, getting that social proof. Uh, and that's, that's a really cool trade for me. If I can get uh, 100 uh, consultants helping, you know, turning around to say, hey, you know, I just got my first deal, just got my first lead, just got my first sale. Um, I, I want to be able to put that on my website uh, so people can see that it's working for so many people. So that's really, you know, my, uh, my motive here. I want to be able to use your success story. I want to, I really want to do that because I know it's only going to help me uh, and it's a really good time for you, uh, whoever's listening right now, to jump on because uh, you get out obviously the super, super cheap price uh, and it's going to help me in the long run uh, with your success story.
Man, that's awesome. Um, you know, I'm looking at, if I just think about, you know, there, there are 20 different niches here. I mean, if all somebody did, if all they got were just the Facebook ad templates and the yeah. banner ads, I yeah. mean, that, that would be, that, that would be more than worth what you, what your, 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 your asking price, um, yeah. what your, your original price would be, let alone this really super discounted price. Um, yeah. man. Okay, so uh, so so when a person, uh, let's say they they go ahead, they're going to get started. David, what's the what's the first thing they need to do? You know, if they have no idea, they never consulted them before. What do you suggest they do first to get into the members area? I would say the first thing is pick a niche. You know, pick the niche that you're more interested in. And we've got twenty niche niche markets at the moment. Uh, we'll be adding another twenty, uh, but. You know, choose a niche that you think would be better suited to you, something that you're interested in. If you're interested in financial services, if you're interested in law, if you're interested in medical, uh, whether that's uh, real estate, uh, you know, people are interested in different things. You know, maybe you're interested in, um, you know, wedding, weddings, and you could start targeting wedding planners. Uh, there's, there's several different niche markets, but the first thing you should do is choose a niche that, you're you're more interested in don't don't go for all the niches at the same time because that can get really expensive i would highly recommend just take baby steps start with one start setting up the page uh start your first ad start generate getting your first lead and go through the process with one uh, i know once you log in it might be overwhelming because you're like well there's so many niche markets i can tap into but just start with the one you're most interested in and uh, and that way you won't get bored of it um, when you're going through this process. That's awesome. Okay, everybody, this has been David Kassar. I'm, I'm glad uh, I'm having a chance to talk to him. Um, this is the Consultants Pack. And, and again, man, I'm really excited about this because, again, j just for somebody who's new and, and they have no idea about how to consult, I mean, they can get in here and they've got everything. You've done all the work for them. Yeah. Uh, yeah. To, and, and 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 again, the important stuff, right? You you did the important stuff, like as I said, the the uh, you know the, te the the proposal is really what throws me. And you've already done all this stuff for them, so I mean, I think that's really cool. So everybody, um, there's a link right here below. If you're watching this on YouTube, you're going to see a link across the screen. Um, depending on when you see this, I don't know how much longer the pricing is going to be the way it is, and you're going to yeah, see yeah. it's really. Uh, it's it's really it's really it's really low. So go ahead and uh, and, and get it now, and then uh, and then you'll be all set. So David, thank you again um, for 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 spending some time with me. Awesome. Thanks for having me.